So today I'm flashing one of the uh, translator kits to be an AC charge limit kit. This one's for a 40 kilowatt hour car. This is the uh, translator kit box, which I flash using EV's enhanced service reporting tool and their fantastic uh, kit to supply power. This would allow me to use um, Leaf Spy on a loose battery with uh, different set of connections that I can just plug in. So it's all very universal. It's a full kit, so it's got all the wiring and brackets and everything in it. And it only takes a few minutes to uh, program the thing up. So here's the programming screen. Uh, the translator, I can either put a translator kit in or as soon as I can find it. There we go. That's um, selected the charge limit kit for the 40 kilowatt hour battery. I'll put a link to the uh, video showing how to use the AC charge limit kit, which can be controlled from sitting in the driver's seat. It's all brilliant. And here we go. This shows the screen with it all programmed up. I could actually select an 80% charge limit here and now, but it's so easy to do from on board that there's no point in doing it. I let it go out at 100% and then the customer can change it when they need it. So here's the unit finished off with a label so we know what's inside it. One of the real advantages of these is that they can be reflashed later, either on the car or off the car through the post if necessary to be a uh, battery translator if a battery upgrade is done or if perhaps in the limiting situation the car gets crashed the kit can be pulled off and used on any leaf that has the newer battery style and the matching connector to go with it there's a separate kit with a different loom for the earlier wiring loom that comes on the car um, but yeah they're they're usable forever for all different reasons if the AC charge controller for some reason becomes surplus to requirements.